Good morning, everyone. I'm Jan Carabello with your morning digital news brief for Sunday, February 20th. Investigators are working to determine what caused a fire at a farm in Atlantic County. Crews responded to that scene at Hidden View Farms in Egg Harbor City just after 11 o'clock Saturday night. The fire captain is expected to give more details later today. Jonathan Wisniewski, the former principal of Primos Elementary in Delaware County, is behind bars facing multiple child sexual assault charges today. Officials say Wisniewski assaulted a 13-year-old girl years ago. They believe there may be more victims. A preliminary hearing for Wisniewski is set for March 1st. And today is the last day of Penn State University's THON. Thousands of students have been on their feet since Friday, raising money and awareness for childhood cancer. So today at four, dancers will stop moving their feet and organizers will announce the year-long fundraising total. This is Thon's 50th year. More than $190 million have been raised to date. Now to the eyewitness for the forecast with meteorologist Tammy Sees. Hi, Tammy. Well, hello, Jan. They're about to stop, and the weather's about to get spectacular for them by tomorrow. Uh, what we're tracking is a sunny and cool day today. We'll be right around 40 degrees. That's a little below average, but plenty of sunshine out there, much less breezy as well. A beautiful but warm holiday tomorrow. We're going to be looking at the upper 50s. We're looking at more 60s this week, Tuesday and Wednesday. But they do come with a chance of rain. So outside, we have nothing but high pressure in place. Lots of sunshine. Happy sunshine today. That is what high pressure is, the sinking warming air that usually clears things out. This extends well back to the plains. So we're going to enjoy this high pressure. Cold air is coming around it, though, clockwise. That's the airflow around high pressure. So this is the coolest of the days, and then say the next four or five days. Then we see this high pressure scoot off to our east. Here comes that warm air on the return flow around taking us to the 50s tomorrow. You notice there's also a warm front creeping in off to the west. This launches north of us, so the next storm system places us in the warm sector. This is the rain we'll see Tuesday, and we are going to be in the 60s. Wednesday, we are still in the warm sector, maybe a shower in the morning, then cloudy, but we'll be in the 60s on Wednesday. Then the front lays down on top of us. We could see a rain snow mix early on Thursday, and then again late as this system passes by on the front. And on Friday, right now, it looks like rain, but we're keeping an eye on the possibility of there being sleet or snow as well. Rain chances this week, none for today and tomorrow, but look at Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. This is your official umbrella alert. 40, that will be your high today. Sunny and cooler, a little less breezy, so it should be pleasant out there. No snow squalls today. 29 for tonight, that is a seasonable night out there. 58 tomorrow, 61 with rain Tuesday. 66 with rain in the morning on Wednesday, then back to the 40s for Thursday and Friday with the chance of that mixing both days. And then only 35 on Saturday. Not a bitter blast headed our way, Tim. All right, Tammy, thank you. And remember, you can always get the latest news and weather headlines right here on CBSPhilly.com. I'm Jan Carabello. Have a great day.